Hi, everyone. This is Leah McCabe, founder of Autism Wish and host of the Embracing Autism podcast. I am here to show you some awesome resources that we have for you guys. These are absolutely free resources that we have gotten from our partner, Kind Theory. Um, you can visit them at kindtheory.org. Um, and I'm just going to show you how to get those resources and a little bit about what they are. So if you look at my screen here and you navigate to autismwish.org, we have this new resources tab up here in the navigation. And under our resources section, we currently have our support group, which is a virtual parent support group. And this is a Facebook group. Um, and you can essentially join in that group. And we meet virtually once a month. Typically, it's on the first Saturday of each month at 8 p.m. Eastern. And this is a place where parents can get together and talk about, you know, parenting autism, give each other advice, support, tips, all sorts of stuff. Or if you just need to like hang out with some friends who get what it means to be a special needs parent, that's an area for you to go. Um, and then we've got some really cool resources here. Um, we have the weekly planner, a visual schedule, and a transition social story. And these were provided to us by Kind Theory. So I'll just show you a little bit of these. So here is the weekly planner. And as it downloads here, you can see that it was especially designed for us at Autism Wish. So this was made specifically for you, our Autism Wish followers. And essentially, this is a weekly planner that will help your kids schedule plans and activities over a week of time. And it's made to help your child be able to manage time and track their tasks. So what we have here is a printable that is made for an A3, which is kind of like a standard printer paper. And we've got some reusable activity flashcards. These can be cut out. Um, so you can print them and cut them and use them to make a little activity out of it. Um, and you can take those cards and post them onto the day of the week here in the calendar. Um, so for example, if we look up here, you can say like early morning on Monday, um, you might be going to school and then perhaps you'll be making lunch. So you would cut those out and you would paste them here in the box below and you can accommodate that print out as many as you'd like to make as many copies or versions as you'd like to help your child plan for their day. It also comes with some helpful instructions. So you know how to use this product. And then let me just navigate back here and I'll show you our next free resource. This one is right here, the visual schedule. So if you go and click on visual schedule, you'll get another printable. This is essentially exactly what it sounds like. It's a visual schedule. And again, it comes with some instructions in the beginning to help you kind of understand the reason behind it. So this one's specifically to help reduce confusion and anxiety and help your child become more independent. Um, so then if you just scroll down, you'll see that there is a daily routine checklist and it gives you kind of like the morning routine, getting up in the morning, brushing your teeth. You have the days of the week to kind of check off per day. And you also have the time here. So you can mark it down to whatever time that would normally be for your child. You can customize it. And if you scroll down, there's also options for activities in the afternoon, such as lunch, coming home from school. And of course, you have the nighttime routine here as well. So this is something that is particularly helpful for kiddos who may be on the nonverbal side of the spectrum, or if they just have a hard time staying on task, this is a good resource for that. Um, again, this is completely free, um, and it goes essentially from the beginning of your morning all the way to the end of the day where it's time for bed. Here, I will navigate now to the final free resource we have right now, and this is the Transitions Social Story. So I'm going to go ahead and click on that. Now, as you see when I'm scrolling down here, this is a social story. If you're not familiar with social stories, they're essentially stories that are created with pictures and easy to read language to help teach children how to handle certain transitions. And so this one is a story of a kid named Jonah. And as you go through this, you would be reading this to your child and it's essentially going through his day, things that he likes to do. And then these are um, teaching him how to start and end these transitions. So if you scroll down, it'll tell you the emotions that he feels when he has to end an activity that he really likes, the fact that it's okay to feel these emotions and what to do 
um, when you are essentially feeling these emotions. So it helps your child kind of learn how to regulate and um, stay on task as well. So this is also available on our website as a free download. And again, you just navigate to autismwish.org, hover over the resources tab, and you'll find those all here. If you are subscribed to our newsletter, you should have also received two of these resources in your inbox earlier. And um, I would recommend that if you have not yet, go ahead and subscribe to our newsletter because we send out newsletter exclusive things like sign up for gifting events. Um, if you have not signed up yet, you just go to autismwish.org here. And then you just scroll down to the middle of the page. And right here, you will see the subscribe section. So you just enter your email address there, click subscribe, and you're in. And that's pretty much all I have for you. I hope that this is a helpful resource. I hope you guys really get some um, value out of this. And if there's any other resources you guys would be interested in, just shoot us an email, info at autismwish.org, and we'd be happy to see what we can do. Thanks, and I hope you guys enjoy. Bye.